What is up guys, welcome back to another video. So today I thought I'd go through summer wardrobe essentials. I feel like must have items for summer. Summer is fast approaching, it's basically here now, isn't it? So we need to make sure we've got the wardrobe in line. We're looking fresh, we're looking good when we're going on holidays and nights out, going to the festival, maybe going to a rave or something like that. So let's get straight into the video. As always, I'll link all the items I talk about in this video in the description. So go and have a look down there. And if you do enjoy this sort of content, don't forget to drop it a like. Let's crack on with it. So I'm gonna break it down into each clothing category, different sections. So we've got shorts, trousers, pants, tops, like shirts, t-shirts, vests, that sort of thing, shoes, trainers, accessories. So we're gonna start off with shorts first because I feel like shorts are just a staple for summer. Obviously when it's on holiday and it's dead hot, you're not gonna to want to wear trousers or jeans or something like that, are you? So we're gonna start off with shorts. I've got loads of shorts. This doesn't mean that you need to have all of these shorts. These are just my favorites and I feel like must haves for summer. So we'll start off with swimming shorts. Swimming shorts are an absolute must. Obviously, if you're on holiday, I feel like the place to go for swimming shorts for me is H&M. H&M have some absolute classic swimming shorts, really affordable as well. So I picked these up yesterday. Just a black pair of swimming shorts in a nylon material, mid-length, $12.99. What an absolute bargain. It's got a bit of writing down the side. I feel like when you go too short, unless you've got massive legs, going too short looks a bit too much. So I feel like a mid-length is perfect for me. And we've got, again from H&M, in this like sage green colour. Very similar price. These ones actually have got zip pockets, which is a very nice touch. So swimming shorts, obviously I've got loads of other colours as well, but these are just my two favourites at the minute. H&M is definitely my go-to. ASOS has some good ones as well, but yeah, H&M is my go-to for swimming shorts. Moving on to, so like shorts for in the daytime. So we have got quite a few options to be honest. Depends what sort of vibe you're going for, but I feel like you do need a jogger pair of shorts. You know, just like a classic gray pair of jogger shorts. I feel like traveling in these sorts of shorts is really good, like an airport outfit. Be really nice. These are just from Legend London. They've got them in this color and they've got black and cream as well, which is really nice, but super, super comfy. And I wear a size large in there and then Cargo shorts, again, is a must have, in my opinion. I absolutely love cargo shorts. My favorite cargos at the minute are just from Jack and Jones. So I got these from ASOS, but the Jack and Jones through ASOS. And it's really nice, like stone gray color. I think these are 30 quid. Um, again, just a, just a classic short arm. You can dress these down a bit, or you can dress them up if you're going out at night with these. We've got these, which are like a, a pleated scuba short from ASOS, and they were like 20 quid. In a really nice like charcoal color. They're a staple for my wardrobe. Maybe like wear a nice white shirt tucked into this. T-shirt, oversized T-shirt with this, mega. Another option is obviously denim shorts. You can't really go wrong with denim shorts. These are just from ASOS again. I feel like ASOS just absolutely smashes it, obviously. I know the quality is not the best, but they absolutely just kill it with the price, the fit. I'm a 34 waist in these, and they fit me spot on. Another really nice pair of shorts. These are a bit smarter. These are from Arnclo. These are the Lux Essential Short, I think. And I wear a size large in these. Again, they've got a pleat down the front, so they're very similar to the other ones. But I'd say that you could dress these up a little bit more, a bit, bit smarter. They've got loads of colors. I've got this nice charcoal color but I've also got this stone color as well. I think they've got black navy. So all the colors that you need, this color is the one. Final pair is just another like comfy pair of shorts. These are a bit like a, a jacquard material. I think that's how you say it. You can dress them up, dress them down, wear them to the airport. These are just from Arnco again. Arnco have got some absolutely sick stuff over on their website. Just super minimal basics, but looking really good and the fit is spot on as well. So moving on to pants, trousers next. I feel like I always prefer wearing pants, trousers at night. You know, if it's a bit cooler, like on holiday, but like in Spain or Greece, Italy, somewhere like that. So first pair, Mauve Smart Cargo Pants, an absolute classic fit. Really comfy, really nice material. And they look a bit smarter than say like a normal cargo pant. Then we have got another pair of cargo pants, but I feel like these are a bit more casual. So you could wear these maybe to the airport or you could still wear them going out at night with like maybe an oversized graphic tee like this new Sulfit one. So we've got two from Jack and Jones, the exact same pair, just in different colors. So 
They're like a, a tapered carrot fit. They're honestly so nice. My favourite cargoes at the minute before we bring out sulfur ones. Sulfur ones are going to change the game. They're going to be so good. But in a really nice like khaki green colour. And then we've got them in black too. Like I said before guys, everything will be linked below. But yeah, a bit more of a, a casual vibe. So comfy. A really, really nice cargo pant these. Then if you want something like a little bit more smarter to wear at night, I feel like the uh, Lux Essential Trouser from Arm just can't be beaten. It just can't be beaten. They do them in navy stone, charcoal and black. So you, you're covered in all colours basically. I've got literally all colours, to be honest. <laughs> I have all colours. We've got the charcoal and the black. You just can't beat them. They're so comfy, very smart, super lightweight as well. And you can just pair like loads and loads of outfits with them. You can wear a shirt, wear a t-shirt, wear a polo shirt, a zip polo. This colour might be my favourite, you know, like a nice stone colour. So nice. And then if you want a bit more of even, an even smarter pair, I've got a pair of trousers from Reese. Reese again is an absolute classic, but it is a bit more expensive. So just bear that in mind. I think these were, I think I got them in the outlet, but they should have been 130 quid. Like a Brighton trouser in a navy colour. Super lightweight material, a little bit more flowy, not as tight as well. So if you want stuff to be not as tight, definitely have a look at these. Really nice. It's getting warmer today, you know, start of summer. Definitely here in the UK. Got myself a nice cold Iron Brew Sugar Free. I'll tell you what, need to check out Iron Brew if you haven't. Scottish Heritage. That's the one. All right, so before we go on to accessories next, I feel like accessories are an essential for summer. Got sunglasses, necklaces, rings, bracelets, all that good stuff. So let's start with sunglasses. I feel like sunglasses are like my most lost item in my wardrobe. They're so easy to lose on holiday in the sea, by the pool. So easy to lose. So I've got a few cheaper pairs, got an expensive pair. Cheap pairs from H&M. I think these were $7.99 or $6.99 bit of a square frame. I feel like when you go for sunglasses, you need to find ones that suit your face shape. So bigger ones for me suit my face shape because I've got quite, quite a big head. Saying it how it is, I've got quite a wide head. So I need bigger sunglasses. Those small round ones just don't look good on me at all. So these seven quid, not bad. We've got a pair from ASOS. I think these are like 13, 14 quid. These are really nice, these. Like a wayfarer. Look alike, Clubmaster. And then my expensive pair is from Ray Ban. I wear these all the time, but I try not to wear them when I'm going out and have the potential to lose them. Do you know what I mean? So nice. Very nice, so sunglasses are an essential, make sure you get some of them involved. And then we'll move on to necklaces. So I'm wearing this like compass necklace from a brand called Rose Gold and Black. I feel like Rose Gold and Black is just the place to go if you wanna get necklaces, rings and bracelets. They have sponsored today's video, so a massive thank you to them. But these are the only accessories, the only necklaces, bracelets and rings I wear. They've got loads of different choices, like this pendant one here is so nice, a little bit longer. Wear it with like a nice open shirt or a t-shirt like I'm wearing here. This compass one I've been wearing a lot recently. It's like one of my new favorite things. They've obviously got the minimal bar necklace as well. Don't know if you can see it. Very smart. And then bracelets are a must have in my opinion as well. Just like some minimal break beaded bracelets like that. And then you've got ones that you can actually fasten to, which is very ideal and then rings as well I don't usually wear rings but i do really like the ones from rose gold and black so if you do want to check out any necklaces rings or bracelets there'll be a link right at the top of the description guys go and have a look down there you need to get some involved you can use my code josh for an extra 10 percent off which is a nice bonus touch but yeah definitely must haves for summer so i thought i'd break tops t-shirt shirts down into a few different subcategories so we've got t-shirts and polo shirts in this one I feel like you can't go wrong with just a white plain t-shirt. This one is just from Sulfur Clothing, one of the white premium tees. We've got white oversized tees dropping soon with this print on as well. So 
Make sure you keep your eyes peeled for new sulfate releases. Wiping room tea is the one. We've also got the charcoal oversized tea. I feel like you do need a few oversized teas for holiday. Really nice and comfy. And oversized teas, I feel like you don't get as hot in oversized teas. Do you know what I mean? It's nice and flowy, which feels pretty good. You can also get graphic teas as well. We've got this graphic sulfate tea dropping very soon, mid to end of June. So make sure you keep your eyes peeled for that. Just absolutely spot on. I love it. I've been wearing it all the time. Moving on to stuff that is a little bit more smart, a little bit smarter. So we've got polo shirts. I do love wearing a few polo shirts on holiday. So we've got one from H&M. If you've seen my recent H&M haul, you would have seen this. It's like a Revere collar, $9.99 in a beige color, $9.99. That's ridiculous. Obviously, I know the quality is not going to be outstanding, but if you get a couple of wears out of it on holiday, a tenner, it's a bargain. We've got Calibre polo shirts, zip polos from Calibre are mega. I think they're doing a new release soon, so go and check that out because they've been struggling to get stock, I think. So keep an eye out for them because they're like zip polo shirts are really nice quality, super luxurious. And they look smart, they look sick for summer, don't they? Then we have got Arn and Reese. I feel like Arn is like the cheaper version of Reese, basically. They're very, very similar, aren't they? So, Again, this is like the matching set to the shorts that I showed you, the Arn shorts. Jacquard material polo, really, really nice. Super comfy as well, but looks very smart. You can wear these with like some of the Arn looks essential trousers and it will look class. And then we've got the Reese um, zip polo in Air Force Blue, I think it's called. Really, really nice. I got this from the um, designer outlets. I feel like it's good to go to the outlets because you can save quite a bit of dough. You can save quite a bit of money and get some good bargains. Right, let's move on to shirts. We've got short sleeves and long sleeves as well. I've got quite a lot, haven't we, in this video. We've got a lot, a lot of areas covered. I know we have got a lot of stuff in this video. I'm not saying you have to buy everything. This is just basically my wardrobe, what I'm going to be wearing for, for summer. And I know my style isn't going to be for everyone, but I feel like you can take away some inspo from this video, definitely. So we've got shirts next. H&M have got some really nice flowy short sleeve shirts. I actually got the same shirt in two colours. So we've got it in like this really nice black and white striped. Size large in that. I'm six foot two, around 200 pounds at the minute. And then we got it in this nice blue colour. I feel like these sorts of shirts are really nice to wear with like a white vest. So I got a white tank top. You can wear it like open, can't you? With a white vest underneath. It's a really nice look for summer and keeps you nice and cool as well. We also got this really nice short sleeve shirt from Tailored Athlete. So Tailored Athlete is a brand that I've been wearing for quite a while to be honest. It's a bit more premium but they tailor for people who are a little bit bigger who go to the gym and work out and their clothes are so nice. Like the material is spot on and they brought out this really nice like geoprint short sleeve shirt so I'll be giving that a whirl. I'm a size extra large in Tailored Athlete. We've also got this nice flowy shirt from Zara. Can't be Zara. Just make sure you try and get like a stretch material. Stretch material is the one. This would be the one for like a festival or um, say if you're into Ibiza or Marbella, somewhere like that. That'd be lovely. Then I feel like it is good to have some long sleeved shirts as well. Even though it is going to be warmer at night, it's always a bit cooler, isn't it? So got if you want a cheaper option H&M is the place to go in my opinion they do a really nice slim fit long sleeve shirt We've got loads of different colors as well this is from I think this is from a couple of years ago to be honest a nice dark green color but they've got loads of different options and then we've got tailored athlete again if you want to spend a little bit more money and want a premium material tailored athlete is the one the shirts are just really really nice fitting honestly like form fitting but not too tight the material is spot on and again I wear a size extra large in these bad boys. I feel like a lot of people don't talk about fragrances and fragrances for summer, they do change a little bit, don't they? You want something that's a bit more tropical, a bit fruity, a bit lighter. I'll show you the ones I'm gonna be wearing. So we've got V Saint Laurent Y. Very, very nice fragrance. It lasts for ages as well. It's quite strong, so you don't need loads of sprays, but very decent. We've got Carolina Herrera Bad Boy. Another classic. A little bit more suave, would you say? Sophisticated, maybe wear this at night time. And we got a cheaper one, Vibrant Leather, just from Zara, actually, believe it or not. And this is like, I feel like it's a cheaper version of Creed Aventus, Aventus Creed. 
Definitely is, you know. It doesn't last as long, but it's a good, like, daytime fragrance, do you know what I mean? Yeah. You just want something a bit lighter. And then, in my opinion, the go, I just think you just can't beat this. Blue de Chanel. It's just lovely. You can obviously get the Eau de Parfum version. This is just the Eau de Toilette. But regardless which one you get, they're all really nice. This lasts for ages as well. I love wearing this one at night. It does just finish off an outfit. You feel good when you've got a nice fragrance on, don't you? This is my favorite part, to be honest, trainers. As you guys know, I do love my trainers. I don't really tend to wear shoes. So for me on holiday, I'll just be taking flip-flops and trainers. Maybe I'll take a pair of loafers. I do like loafers, don't get me wrong. Driving shoes, loafers, but they just tend to rub, you know, on the back of your heel. So trainers I'll be taking, I picked up these Pumas. I think they're called SB Low or something like that. Rebound SB Low. They look like dunks, don't they? They actually do look really like Nike dunks. And they're from Cheshire Oaks. I can't find them online anywhere. On Cheshire Oaks, 38 quid. And if you spend over 60 quid, no, if you spend over 80 quid, you get 20 quid off. So we got two pairs. I've got Laura a pair as well. Maybe I'll be traveling in these. So nice, like a navy blue color. Class. If you want a bit of a smarter pair, going out at night, Axel Arigato Genesis, uh, a really good shoe slash trainer. I really like the shape on these. I think Arn have done a similar shape, similar version, haven't they, as well? Yeah, they're mega as well. And then we have got another pair from Puma. You've seen me talk about these quite a bit. Puma, CA Pros, big fan of these. I think I, I just got them from ASOS. I think they retail at 70 quid. Yeah, just try and get them when there's like discount codes on, do you know what I mean? Try and save yourself a bit of money. Really nice holiday trainer again. Puma are killing it, aren't they? They're basically just copying Nike. Basically. Very similar to Nike anyway. But Nike resale prices, I just can't be asked paying those resale prices. I think like it's just ridiculous. For a pair of Nike dunks, especially on the quality, I just feel like there's no point on them. Last pair of trainers I'll be taking on holiday is do need to give these a bit of a wipe over to be honest, but they're on essential leather trainers. They have loads of different colors in these. They've got triple white, they've got black with a white sole. I feel like they've got navy as well, but these gray, this gray colorway. I do love gray. I do love my grays in a minute. Super comfy, I'm true to size. These are quite true to size, or size UK 10. But yeah, Arn have got some absolutely class footwear on their website and it's not too expensive, do you know what I mean? I feel like Cleans is another good, good website as well. If you want some like kind of premium designer trainers, but I've not, I'm yet to try Clean, so I need to try them. I'll be doing a video on them shortly. But yeah, that's all the summer essentials. I know this video is quite long, quite in depth, quite detailed, but yeah guys, hopefully you can take away a few ideas for summer, a few fashion ideas, a bit of inspo for your outfits if you're on a holiday with the missus or with the lads. Whatever you're doing, and hopefully this video can help you out. Like always, everything will be linked in the description. So go and have a look down there and don't forget to go and check out today's video sponsor, Rose Gold and Black. For the best minimal accessories in the game, bracelets, rings, necklaces, you name it, they've got it. Go and check them out. Well, that's it from me today, guys. I'll be doing like a summer outfits video in the upcoming weeks before I go on holiday. So keep an eye out for that. But I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.